favorite people. Welcome to... Hey, you, you oh, didn't sorry. let me say my thank you. Okay, okay, let's try this again. Hey, favorite <laughs> people. No, it's the moment passed. I can't do no. it now. Oh, did I ruin it? Yeah, you ruined MK me. Okay, the ruiner. You ruined me forever. That's it. I'm oh, gone. I, I, I quit. No That's video for me. Oh. See you later. Um, oh. Okay. I think Gary Maybe. just... I think Adulgit just rage quitted our co-op episode. Well, I rage rejoined, so that's it. That's, it sounds dangerous. I, about it. Sounds really dangerous. <laughs> well, <laughs> it anyways, is, but I can handle it. Here we are on the Koala Craft Feed the Beast server, and before we get started on the main content of our video, I wanted to show you a little something that the Clever Creeper did for me. Um, I was over working on the train station, which is back behind Sigil's house. And he was on, and he was like, hey, MK, I noticed you didn't have a house yet. And I said, yeah, you know, I've been kind of busy doing municipal builds. And he said, well, we all kind of thought that you'd be, the, you know, the first one to put up a, a crazy house. And I said, well, you know, you know, someday, sometime I'll get around to doing that, yeah? And he was like, well, let me help you out with that. And, um, like, a little while later when I came back, this was what uh, was here. Little tiny dirt house, clever creeper contractors, the CCC. There's a tree not really a roof. It's um, yeah, that's against uh, city ordinances, but I guess we'll let it slide. Trees inside houses. Well, if we're against trees inside houses, I would say that several of our uh, <laughs> There's one over there. Members are violating building codes. Anyway, uh, what else do we want to talk about? Oh, were we? Let me see. Let me see. Um, I haven't done a whole ton on City Hall because I've been turning my attention gradually toward this, the train station project. Isn't that right, Gary? Yep. It's also kind of hard to, like, stay focused when you're right across from a really awesome house. It's so true. So true. Mm -hmm. Look at this really awesome house right here that Gary made. Pretty, pretty oh, crazy. actually... I'm going to super, super quick show you guys my favorite, well, okay, one of my favorite things about his house, which is this epic little interior garden. This makes me so, so happy. Love mm -hmm. it. And before I forget, one of my subs asked me to showcase the power plant because they were interested in doing something similar on their Feed the Beast server. So let's just run I over guess, here. I guess now I have to go too. Ugh. Come on, Gary. Come on. Just deal with it. <laughs> And it's a very, very simple design. Basically, there are solar panels on the top of these two towers. Let's climb the scaffolding. It's really cool, too. I wonder whose idea it was for it to build it over here. To build it here in this little... Yeah. This, is, this was actually Sigils. He just came over here right when I, we were starting to lay out the streets for Spawn Town and just put it over here. Nope. I told him to build it over here. Oh, you did? Yep. My bee. <laughs> get, it, get it right or pay the price. Uh-oh. So yeah, it's it's very simple. The building is more or less just for show. Employees only. Got... You can't go back there. It says employees only. I am the city architect. Okay. Well, I can't go back there. I'll wait out here. I'll just okay. throw some goo. I'll throw some goo in there if you don't mind. Oh my gosh! No, I'm kidding. <laughs> there's there's nothing really to see here. It's just a uh, just nothing pipes. to see here. Just pipes. So yeah, and then the pipes run. I don't know exactly which direction they run, but I think they must run through this mountain or something. And under this no, little No, actually, river. they go under the water a little oh, bit. You can they, see some there. Oh, that is so oh. cool. Yeah, so the pipe runs underwater, and then it powers. Uh, it may not be. It could just be, yeah, it could. this could just be a dedicated line to here. Yeah. It, it, it might go underneath the mountain, as you said, though. I'm not uh -huh. sure. Yeah. And uh, just about every single plot is powered now. At one point, they were all powered, and then we expanded a little bit and added a couple more plots. And I'm not 100% sure if all of those are powered. But Pretty much, I think for the most part, everything has a power line on at least one street underneath the street. Because mm -hmm. if, if you look, because you didn't bother to show oh, yeah. the people this. Yeah, I'm terrible. If you look under, <laughs> if you look under there's power lines under all the streets. Well, yeah. most of the streets, as I was yeah, saying. Yeah, they just, they just run. It's, I, I think it's really there. cool. It makes oh, me go, hey, you don't be a jerk. <laughs> don't be a jerk. <laughs> you damn jerk face. Hey, don't, I say that. <laughs> Three to one, I just stole your slogan. <laughs> oh, yeah, well, uh -oh. you're the worst, you're the worst uh -oh. at it, so. Uh-oh, uh-oh. It doesn't matter. Uh-oh. <laughs> I'll kill you with the chainsaw. No, not the chainsaw. All I have is an iron pick right now. That all sucks of my to you. All of my tools have started breaking, and I don't have the time or resources to actually make new tools, aside from, like, random crappy vanilla-type things. Tater Hi. smack. Whoa, that is so rude. 
<laughs> so, oh, hey, tell me what um, I've been wondering. What is the block off of Mackenzie's house that is showing the smoke? What what is it, doing that? It is a smoke jet that you can get in the Twilight Forest if you want to look at it. I also made a little addition to it uh, the the other day. Uh-huh. I'll show you it. <gasps> oh, right. you made it with a brick with mm-hmm. brick thingy things. Yeah. Oh, that's so cute. I love it. Yep. You should. Build I think the it brick actually gives higher. off mo- more smoke without it. Well, maybe not. You but should. I tried to put two. I tried to build it up like a full chimney. Uh-huh. But if you do that, the smoke shoots out in weird directions. I don't know why. Oh, bummer. That's too bad. Yeah. You might be able to work it if you put the jet up higher and like put covers around it. I haven't tested with it, but I just did that. Yeah. Just really or quick. like if you were to make it, make the chimney not actually on top of the block at all. Yeah. Like if you put blocks underneath this and then just put uh-huh. the, put like covers around the the uh smoke jet block and then just put that on top oh, of it yeah. then it might work. yeah that'd be cool yeah that's, so you could hide yeah. it so you don't see it because it, it looks it it uh blends to whatever color grass is around it so it'll just be like oh, green nice so anyway the train station my original concept had been to kind of do a grand central station from manhattan kind of look with it sunken into the ground large arched windows and then a partially flat topped roof with one arch going along the short side but with railcraft and everything, and with there being so many beautiful things to look at in this world, everybody's been talking about wanting to do like a monorail or, I mean, I guess above ground transportation, which obviously would look much, much cooler. So the question is, do we want to sink, like sink the train tracks down, have them go under to get like outside of Spawn Town so that they don't clutter it up and then pop up above ground? I kind of like that idea, actually. Yeah, we could do it. But if we had to do anything above ground, the only direction we could really go is probably this way. Yeah. Because there's not really anything in the way. Yeah. So, yeah, I guess for right now, my vote is for starting with sinking the lines. And then once they get outside of Spawn Town, we can pop them, pop them above the ground. Well, how are we going to do it from the train station? Is there going to be tracks going in three, four different directions or no? What I was thinking was... Um, basically just okay so in his single player world sigils had a subway system that had basically like a couple of deeper grooves cut into the floor that was already sunken in and um and he laid tracks along those and they all were parallel to each other and they would exit out one of the two short sides of the walls. But then after they left, they would split off and go in all their different directions. Okay. Makes sense. So, yeah. But anyway, um, I don't know anything about this part of Minecraft, about, about mine carts and all that stuff. About anything that doesn't involve building. Pretty much. Yep. You called <laughs> there you it. Go. You called it. MK yep. the buildiest. Mm-hmm. MK the worst builder. No, not true. False. What? Oh. Oh hey, it's nighttime. Dun, dun, Uh-oh. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> as they as the song says, the freaks come out at night, so watch your back. Hey. Wait. Hey, you just uh, admitted that you're a freak, so <laughs> Well, I guess my secret is out. <laughs> okay, the freakiest. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, I'm hungry. Okay. So, yeah, I don't know. I don't know really what to do next. Let's go ahead and just, like, wall off the ceiling. Although I'm thinking, now that I've kind of gotten it this far, I actually want to do maybe a glass roof. How cool would that be? Like, just over this part yeah, or the just, entire room? Just over the... Just over the arch? Yeah, just over this part of the arch. So starting, like, right, I guess, maybe here? What do you think? And since we... um, Starting over where? Right here? Uh, either there or the one right below it. Here. Um, come uh, over... Come over here and take a look, like from, from, or I guess actually we really should be looking at it from the ground. I get so um, <laughs> caught up in having a jetpack that I never look at the way builds are going to look from the ground. Yeah. Yeah, maybe right here. Mm-hmm. The problem and is with it, it sure. it's not like it, it's not like a huge arch. So if you cut it off or let it go too far, it's going to look too weird. So you yeah. want a solid yeah. wall. 
but uh, nothing too high where it starts, if you know what I'm trying yeah, to say. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I think this one should be it. Because you, you don't want to make it look like just a huge biodome or something, and you also don't want to make it look like a little sunroof. Or... Well, what if we did? what if we did stripes? Like alternating glass and... Strips of glass? Well, I was going to say like alternating glass and another block. Like uh, we could bring... We could bring the marble back in, or um, which which direction though? Stripes. Um, oh, uh, I want stripes this way, like going. Or? Yeah, stripes going the long way. Stripes like cutting direction. across it, or going going the long way. Okay, stripes, yeah. yeah. Stripes going the way I'm running, from here to here. Eternity. Oh wait. <laughs> Infinity and beyond. <laughs> wait, is that copyrighted? Yep, it is, and you just got sued. Crap. 60. Man, I am just like, oh for two you, <laughs> on the being you, sued front. <laughs> you guys watching will never know what that is because we'll have to bleep it out. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. I just, I just broke, I just broke all the things. So yeah, let's um, let's get some glass. All I By have way, right the, now are glass panes. Are these real uh, half slabs as well? Which ones? The the yeah. staffs, like vanilla half slabs. Oh. Um, I think they are vanilla half slabs. Yes, in this yeah. part at least. I think they become not vanilla half slabs. Maybe down in this section somewhere on the lower if, half of the building. Because if you were not uh, a really rude person and you watched Marty's video, he would explain why it's better to use the micro block half slabs. Because if you change your mind later and you decide you want to add something to it, you can do it. But with the regular vanilla ones, you can't. Mm -hmm. So well, see. You should have watched that. Well, I should, but I only just started using the diamond saw. Maybe. maybe well, like, ignorance is not an excuse. I mean, ouch. That's just so mean. I guess I should work on being less ignorant, though. Oh, I thought you were saying ouch because you were walking on these spiky things. Well, that too. I am the crystal walker. Um, anyway, moving on. Wow, that, that marble in there is really getting cleaned out. Nice. Um... Yeah, so a, here we are. To block you in. Oh, man. I got to be <laughs> careful of that. Here we are 12 minutes into the video and we've done nothing. Mm -hmm. That's how it usually goes, right? <laughs> okay, let's cut out while we make some glass blocks and we'll be right back to place them. Okay. And we're back and yep. we have not accomplished very much yeah. in case you we've can been, tell. <laughs> we've been working on it for about uh, an hour and <laughs> we give up and that's it. We're never going to do it. Yeah, I am never We're just going to throw dirt down here and just call it. That's the building. Yeah, a couple of Let's random see. dirt pillars. This is what mm -hmm. every spawn town needs. A half-finished building with a bunch of dirt pillars. Grand dirt but, pillar central. But in reality... Uh, in, in Minecraft reality, virtual reality. Minecraft... Yeah. Oh, yeah, why do I keep calling Minecraft real life? What's wrong with me? <laughs> is it, for you, it is. That's why. Apparently. Uh, apparently. So anyways, I'm just laying down a little bit of scaffolding so that we, as we're building this roof across, we can just connect the scaffolding. It's kind of like connect the dots, but less fun or maybe more mm. fun, depending on it's, your perspective. Yeah. If it's your cup of tea or not, connect the scaffolding, the new board game coming out. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh, Copyrighted, <laughs> a dual get gaming. <laughs> Koala Brothers. <laughs> I love it. Koala Brothers. That's awesome. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see here. Man, s between Sigils and I, we are going to turn this entire server into a group of people that just sing during their episodes. <laughs> yeah, I know, huh? <laughs> I suppose it's not a bad thing to be known for. You know? You know? Or is you with it? Me? You with me? Oh, man. I was hoping you weren't going to say that, but now I have to kill you. <gasps> because, in fact, the new, the new Koala Craft theme is singing. It's like the singing koalas. The koala mm -hmm. family singers. <laughs> K factor. <laughs> love it. Love it, love it, love it. I love it a lot. Oh man. But so yeah, um you're gonna get voted off the server if you don't start singing. You know. Uh -oh. And that's not supposed to be an ultimatum or anything. That's just the way the world works. Okay, makes sense. Mm-hmm. Everything I say makes sense. Wait, what? <laughs> Everything you make says sense. Oh, no, yeah, not. that too-ish. As you can see, there's already a roof coming together pretty nicely. Once you get those dirt pillars going, it just takes I on a know, life of its own. I know. Gotta love the dirt pillars. They just make it happen. 
And that's what, like, it's a little known fact, but in real life, that's what construction workers use, dirt pillars. Yeah. Yeah, I did not know this until Gary just said this just now, but it makes so much sense that I don't know why, I don't know why it's just not a given for people. Mm -hmm. They they build them in L-shaped form, just like, just like that, too. Uh Uh-huh, uh-huh. In real life. Because that's how physics works. Mm Mm-hmm. Wait, what's physics? (laughs) Just throw throw a little mud or throw a little water on it, make it mud. Then you could shape it however you want. Uh huh. And it'll stay forever and ever. Hmm. Until a creeper blows it up. And I'm talking about real life, not Minecraft. Yeah, it happens to me all the time. I was out walking my cat, and wait, no, I don't do that. What? If you, <laughs> if you, were, <laughs> if you were doing that, then the story would be a lie, anyways, because creepers <laughs> are afraid of uh, cats. Oh, so. man, shoot, shoot. I almost said dog, and then I was like, it'd be funnier if I said cat. And then, man. Nope, you, you failed it. See, trying to make my story interesting just made it backfire. MK the newbiest. MK the bad liar. Mm-hmm. <laughs> How about you, Gary? M- Are you a good liar? Do you have a good uh, poker face? Yeah, I'm, I'm pretty good. I mean, the first le- uh, few letters of my last name is lie, so, I mean, it's kind of a given there. Oh, now we gotta we gotta think about what what Gary's real name might be. Mm-hmm. Look me up and uh, try to stalk me Light if you want. Motif. No Look way. me up on stalk stalker uh, stalkers stalker meet dot com. Wait, what? Look me up on J Date and see if you could. Uh... <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Big revelation, everybody. Gary is Jewish. <laughs> <laughs> or am I? Could just be question, trying to throw you off my trail. Question of the century. No, I bet you can actually be found on ChristianMingle.com. Oh, for sure. <laughs> I mean, they, that ad's plastered all over my uh, YouTube channel. I think Mine it went... too. Mine too. It's like, well... It's ridiculous. One, uh, yeah. One, just no. No. I don't know what's going on here. This... Oh, I think I have... Oh, yeah. No? These are... Oh, I think I started placing regular slabs down and they don't want to work. Oh, interesting. Or... Wait. Or do they? Huh? These are like strips. Did you put these here? Oh, yes, because I'm a noob. Yes, I did oh, that. Oh, you. You're ruining my day here. I didn't know what I was doing. You can just use the, the full slabs. There's yeah, no like that just occurred to me. As as you were saying, who did this? I was like, oh. <laughs> just tried to run away. <laughs> run away. <laughs> Crap. Well, I guess... Clearly, okay, you guys, so I was talking in the KoalaCraft group chat about how I had graduated from needing Gary to make all of my micro blocks for me, but uh, apparently I spoke a little too soon. Mm-hmm. Uh, that was another st- horrible lie that you tried to say I that was untrue. I still a noob. I said I didn't need Gary, and now look what just happened. So hooray for dependency, right? Yep. <sighs> MK the yeah, this- dependent, that's just mm-hmm. weird. MK the neediest. <laughs> I like that. Oh, man. I'm trying yep. to think of a, um overly attached server builder. Can't do anything without people to supply her with blocks. <laughs> what you need to do is uh, you need to start getting that brand out there. Get the shirts. Like, just have it a blank because th- you have so many names. MK the whatever. So just put like MK and with like a, a blank or whatever and MK. fill it in. Insert descriptor here. <laughs> yeah, or MK the blankiest or something. <laughs> oh man, I like that. I like the way you think. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta, uh, you gotta uh, work on uh, personal uh, branding. Yeah. My branding yeah, yeah, like, is that I, I, I'm the. You gotta, you gotta branch out and. <laughs> MK the superlativiest. There you go. Yeah. No one watching knows what that means, but that's fine. Oh, I'm sorry, you guys. I have a degree <laughs> in English, and sometimes I, like, accidentally... It's like, oh, look out, MK, your vocabulary is showing. <laughs> <laughs> um, but anyway, superlatives are just any words saying that you're the best or the worst or the the funniest or, you know, anything that's the E-est, the most or the least of some sort of descriptor is a superlative. That's MK's word of the day, and I can't there believe I actually—I can't believe I actually described, or I can't believe I actually, you know, laid it out for you guys. Because normally I would just splash it up on the screen, but oh well, you get a there different, you. different edition of MK's word of the day where MK talks about her word of the day and doesn't just like drop it in conversation. <laughs> there you go, uh, MK the teachiest. Yeah. 
<laughs> well, someone should probably start working on. Well, the I guess glass. once what I was going to say, someone should probably start working on the arch on that side. But I guess it'll yeah, kind of it's, make it's itself. It's already there. Yeah, that's the best part. Is like once you get the arch done, it's done. Holly, friggin' Luya. There you go. All I can say is thank you for your help. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I will say thank me for my help as well. Mm -hmm. Everybody say thank you to Gary for helping me out with this with this project. Oh my gosh, these dirt pillars. I mean, I know they're just scaffolding, but they're making me angsty. <laughs> <laughs> it's, yeah. like, it's like, who pranked my build with all this dirt? Oh, that was me. <laughs> well, it was probably Austin because he pranked your house with dirt. That's true. Austin, did you put these dirt pillars here? Austin. Yeah, I did. Oh, he, he admitted it. Oh, yep, I heard that. Heard that. He's been in this call this whole time, you guys. <laughs> mm, yeah, that was him. You didn't hear him right now. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, I'm going to break this one down. <sighs> the one thing that kind of could screw you up, too, when you're using these uh, cut blocks is sometimes, because yeah. with the new update now, where it, it pops uh -huh. more of the block back into your hot bar, uh -huh. it'll just grab pretty much any cut block and it'll just pop it yeah, in yeah yeah and then all of a sudden you realize you're using the wrong thing yeah so that's kind of annoying but yeah, yeah just a little bit okay well i think this may be this may be a good enough episode and you guys will just have to wait and see how it looks finished and that's, and that's isn't that how we do it like on our channels we we don't try to do the best episodes for you guys. We just do the ones that are just barely <laughs> good do, enough. We do the mid-level, hey, we're going to show you us working on this about halfway through the project, but we're not going to show you the end of the project. No way. Why would we do that? <laughs> yeah. No, well, this is just good enough. Throw it on YouTube. <laughs> There's no suspense if you get to see the best. Put a couple hair loss uh, head powder ads on it, and it's fine. What? <laughs> you haven't seen those ads? No. Or they, get, they, they take these guys that are balding and they, like, put powder on their head and everyone acts like it's the best thing ever invented. Oh, that's really awkward. It's, like, literally on every video on YouTube and everyone watching this right now is going to be like, yep, I've seen him. And you'll be, you'll be <laughs> the only one that hasn't seen him. See, I think the reason I haven't seen it is probably because Google's not targeting me because I'm a female. Yeah, well, the thing is, too, I'm not uh, Hispanic, so why do they give me ads in Spanish? Because I live in California, is that why? That's racist. Just because no, I live in that's California. that's locationist. That's locationist. Oh, you're right about that. Uh -huh. But it does relate to ra ra race and uh, um, languages, so. Man, this is very quickly becoming a like a political podcast building episode. <laughs> it is, the new podcast. Podcast building. MK and Gary build and talk about important stuff. Mm -hmm. That's how we do it. <laughs> this is how we do Okay. Okay, I think that <laughs> might be <laughs> that might be our cue to to stop recording. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think? Yeah, just, I think this is just. I mean, it's not great, but it's good enough. Yeah, we're gonna leave you guys with this glimpse of these dirt pillars, and actually, I, I am gonna come over here and see this side. Oh, it kind of looks pretty. I kind of like it. All right, thanks so much for your help, Gary. Mm -hmm. Thank you for uh, having me. Mm -hmm. Bye, favorite people. See you in the next episode. My name's See MK. Ya. Over and a dog get here.